A special service has been held in Cornwall this afternoon for a First World War soldier nearly a century after his death. Private Richard Yeo died in 1920 from the wounds he sustained on the battlefield. His name was on Lou's War Memorial, but thanks to the efforts of the Royal British Legion, he's now officially recognised as a casualty of war. Heidi Davy reports. The rain didn't dampen their spirits as family and friends gathered to pay a final tribute to Private Richard Yeo. Almost a hundred years on from his death, he's finally been commemorated with a headstone by the Commonwealth War Graves Commission. It's amazing. I just can't believe it. After 96 years since he died, to think that we're here now remembering him. I think he would be very proud of the people that's here today. And that's quite a very nice good turnout. And it's taken years of research by the Lou branch of the Royal British Legion to make it happen. I feel very proud and it's a very good feeling. It's three years from a first ask for information till we've got to this stage. We pray for those who have given the ultimate sacrifice. We thank you for their love of their country. And we pray for those serving overseas and at home now. Many men and women weren't recognised as war casualties, something the Commonwealth War Graves Commission is keen to rectify. It means a lot to me and obviously to my team as well, because myself and some of my team are ex-military, so it's very important that we remember soldiers from the past. Heidi Davy, BBC Spotlight, in Lou.